have completely destroyed the Wander Wagon. It is a mess. It's in shambles. There's pieces everywhere, screws everywhere. Um, the oven is off. The whole kitchen is destroyed. The whole bathroom is destroyed and we've got a ton of work to do. We were going to focus on the kitchen first and then we had to order the countertops and those said it was gonna take three weeks. So I was like, okay, then I'll focus on the bathroom and start the bathroom. Started the bathroom, gutted it, and the countertops arrived early, two, week, two and a half weeks early. The painting has literally taken me hours. I would say probably eight hours approximately. Um, I'm not a professional painter. I don't paint a lot very often, so I'm definitely slower. Plus, I think in an RV, um, there's just a lot of little things you have to tape off, and it's a lot of little painting sections versus like a big wall in a house. I did two coats of paint within all those hours. I used the Bear Marquis grayish color, and I love the color. I love the tone. I love how it came out. I have painted all of the base cabinets. Wanted to give you guys an update on where I'm at in the painting and in the RV. We were waiting for so long because the weather was so just bad for painting. It was too windy, and there was just no way we could spray the doors. But finally, we got to spray the doors. The drawers and the closet door. So. Yep, that is the rules. Got my little helper here. Help, you can clean too. Okay. stressing out right now because I have all of these like projects half done and nothing's getting done. I painted this yesterday. This used to be a nasty beige color. Now it's black and I'm going to now put on all of the doors because it's just a mess in here and I need to start getting some stuff done. Look how good it looks. So I have this little lip I still need to paint. Um, cause we took off the counter and I still found that sitting there. So, but look how good that looks with like, so we just spray painted the hardware and he sprayed the doors and oh my gosh, I love it. So next I'm doing this. So I wasn't able to get to this when I was painting the bases. So I need to paint the bed and the bathroom. And the bathroom is literally, look at it. Can you even tell it's a bathroom? Probably not. It's like so torn apart right now because Corbin has taken out the toilet and the, the counter's still there, but the sink is gone. Everything is like gone. Corbin's ripped up most of this carpet, but I'm just trying to get like this little edge right here because that's where I'm going to be painting um, just the cabinet part. This is all going to be covered with flooring. Um, have a new toilet. <laughs> um, and I'm also going to paint the top cabinet. And then I might wait on the mirror because I'm not sure if I'm, what color I'm gonna paint it yet. But this is gonna be the same grayish color. And yeah, see, look, the door is already painted. Uh, yeah. The stuff that is done looks amazing. And I can sort of like picture how it's gonna look when it's all done and all together. And I'm just like really excited. Walking through the Wander Wagon, it looks like a lot still even though we have the cabinets painted and there's some stuff done just like looking at the kitchen and it's all tore up and the bathroom it's a little overwhelming but we're making really good progress and i feel like we're going to be able to finish this whole thing by spring um, we have a lot of parts and pieces being shipped right now like the new kitchen sink and the faucets and all that so once we get all that stuff i think it's going to come together really well i cannot believe we went from this to now this and i don't even know what it's going to look like when it's done it's going to blow my mind. Destroying it was a little nerve-wracking, but I know that we're gonna build it to be so much better and make it just more of our mobile home on wheels. So if you like the video, be sure to like it, comment below with what you like about the remodel so far, follow us on Instagram and YouTube, and we'll see you in the next one. We'll be documenting the entire remodel as we have been, and yeah, we're really excited to hopefully finish it soon. Fingers crossed.